Hey guys, I'm Esther from Essie Cooks and in this video I'm going to show you how to make this amazing, delicious chickpea avocado salad with balsamic. It is the perfect side dish. It's the perfect lunch. This is something you're going to want to bring to your next event. Oh, look, someone came here to help me. I guess she's getting a chickpea. <laughs> Um, but I'm super excited to show you guys how to make this chickpea avocado salad. Let's get started. All right, so first up for this salad, we're gonna need three avocados. So if you can, if they're ripe, but still slightly firm, that's ideal. If they're too soft, um, you're gonna have, you know, they're gonna kind of crumble up into the salad, which it's still gonna taste amazing. So don't worry about it too much. I know how hard it is to get avocados perfectly ripe. They kind of all get ripe at once. And if your avocados are all ready and you have three of them, this is the perfect thing to make. I know avocados have a mind of their own. So I'm gonna cut up all my avocados into nice little cubes. And then I've got a quarter cup of diced red onion for this salad as well, which adds so much flavor to it. So we're just gonna finely dice that up. I probably have closer to about a third to a half a cup here, but just you can adjust the measurements how you like them. Then I've got three tablespoons of fresh basil. You can use another herb if you like. And I've got a can of rinsed and drained chickpeas. Now I'm going to add in my freshly chopped basil there. You could use parsley instead or cilantro if you want. I'm going to add in my red onion. Again, I think that's a little more than a quarter cup, but no problem because I do love onions. And I'm going to add in one clove of garlic. So you can either mince that up, grate that up, but I've got my garlic press here. I just find this the easiest. We don't want to hit like a big chunk of garlic. So I'm just going to put that through the press and add that into the salad for some extra flavor. And then I'm going to add in the juice of half a lemon. So I'm just going to throw this into the juicer here and put that all over top of the salad. Now, instead of making our dressing, we're kind of just adding everything to one mixing bowl, which makes it super easy. Now I'm going to add my extra virgin olive oil. I'm putting about two tablespoons spoons you can put more if you like more you can adjust this to your preference then I'm gonna add a little salt and pepper and my secret ingredient is a little bit of sumac if you have it put it in if not don't worry about it um, sumac is such a delicious spice now if you don't have it you could always add a little bit of lemon zest from your lemon in there and that will add a really nice sort of similar flavor in a way so with the avocado you do want to be careful as you're mixing it because you don't want it to fall apart avocados are pretty delicate so we're just going to be careful with these otherwise it's more of like a guac situation than a salad but it's still going to taste amazing now we're going to gently gently mix all of the ingredients together and then i'm going to add in half a cup of vegan feta um, again this is pretty delicate so i don't like to mix it too roughly you want to be pretty gentle mixing it and i'm going to add on just a nice you know generous drizzle of balsamic reduction which makes it taste even better balsamic reduction makes everything taste so good i put it on so many different things especially in the summertime it just seems to be the perfect flavor on top of salads and crostinis and so many different things so i've got that all mixed up there now this will last just a couple days in the fridge um, but it is best eaten fresh right away i would say about two days in the fridge it doesn't last for too long so you do want to serve this up right away if you can now i'm plating this up and this should make about six small side servings or just like four bigger side servings i'm going to add a little bit more of that balsamic reduction to make it taste even better mm. all right time for the taste <laughs> test <laughs> mm, mm, mm. someone's already already testing the taste mm. yum this is the perfect side mm. salad mm. Mm. <laughs> really nice that's so delicious mm. guys if you have the sumac I would highly recommend it mm. it tastes so good on here mm. one word really nice <laughs> <laughs> mm. okay guys thank you so much for watching this video if you like this recipe and you want to see more videos like this one just make sure you hit that like and subscribe button below